All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to fold the three basic folds for the radial paper relief sculpture. So first, I'm going to start with the easiest fold, and that is the hat fold. So I'm going to take my first piece of three inch by three inch paper, and I'm going to use my fingers, and I'm going to fold it in half horizontally. Okay, so then you can see I have my crease line right here, and I have an open side right here. I'm going to keep the open side facing away from me. And I'm going to take this corner and I'm going to fold it up towards the center and make a nice strong crease. And then I'm going to do the same on the opposite side. I'm just going to fold in that corner to the center, make a strong crease. And that is the hat fold. Super simple. Now the next one I'm going to do is the kite fold. So I'm going to start with my piece of paper and I'm going to fold it in half diagonally. So I'm going to line up my corner, I'm going to make a crease, and I'm going to open it up. And I can see my crease line right here in the center. What I want to do is take this side right here and line it up to the middle line. So I like kind of holding this um, up a little bit because it helps me to make my fold a little bit cleaner. Kind of helps like a little ruler for me. I'm going to turn it to the other side and I'm going to do the same over there. And that is the kite fold. Finally is the samurai fold, and this one's a little bit trickier. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start and I'm going to fold my paper in half diagonally one way. Make a nice strong crease. Then I'm going to open it and I'm going to fold it in half diagonally the other way. So now I see an X crease on my paper. Now I want to take it and fold it in half just like it's a little card. So horizontally again. And this is once again going to give me a fold side and an open side. This time I want the open side facing me, so I have it like this. Now I'm going to hold down this side of the paper and I'm going to take this corner and I'm actually going to push in. And it's going to push in pretty easily because we've already made those crease lines there. So I'm pushing it all the way in and pushing down. Taking this side, pushing it all the way in and then folding down. So from above, looks like this. From below, looks like that. All I did was I took these corners and just pushed them in. Now with this top layer of paper, I'm just going to take the top part and fold it in like that. So I'm just taking this line and lining it up to the middle. And do the same to the opposite side. And that is the Samurai Fold. 